this was a three minute video it took about 10 minutes to upload this is a 10 minute video and it looks like it's going to take a good hour to upload and this is a seven minute video and it looks like it will take roughly about 30 minutes to upload this is what google does because google plays games mama ladies and gentlemen this is the last video of this day i need to talk to you guys about something else that's going on there is an issue that I told you was about to happen with China shutting its borders as far as its uh, shipping and their docks and so forth the four largest major shipping ports in the world in China all shut down for what reason because of their zero COVID policy locking the country down because they want to have the Olympics they don't want to go through what Japan went through Remember Japan, how they had to postpone and postpone and postpone China. We ain't Japan. We ain't postponing. That's what China's saying. Well, ladies and gentlemen, by closing those ports, you notice that the cargo ships are not stacking up like they were before. What you don't know is that the United States military has also stopped accepting certain ships. That's why they're having to go to other ports to offload their cargo. What you all don't get, take a look at your food prices. It's not just inflation that they are letting to finally catch up that's causing the prices to be skyrocketing. It is also these cargo ships and the lack of supplies that's causing the food prices to go up because they are already anticipating the clog in the food chain. So stock up on your food now because the prices will continue to go up i did videos in december about this and people are starting to tell me about how high the prices are getting ladies and gentlemen i buy bulk on purpose and i have enough to last me a little bit over a year because i need to have enough to last me a little bit over a year why because too much is going on okay Ladies and gentlemen, it is not my job to keep you guys with all of this. It was just my job to bring this to your attention that the prices will be going up on everything. Gas prices, we're still over $4.65 in the area that I live in. I already know other places are over $5. It will get worse. Sorry. This was a plan. This is not a mistake. I told the person was calling me and they were talking about Russia. And I said, Russia is a distraction. All of that about Russia is a distraction, people. She says, well, what is a distraction of? Uh, the man with the yellow balloon. Everybody's watching the man with the yellow balloon. They're not paying attention to them digging into your pocket. What do you mean by that? Oh, quite simply, food prices, gas prices, all of that stuff is going up and they're distracting you by all these other things so you're not paying as much attention to it so that when it does get really bad, Ladies and gentlemen, they don't want you going and undoing those shelves now. Whoo wee, it'll be too quick. They they can't have that. They can't have everybody stockpiling right now. They need you to wait until it gets real bad. By that time, the people who can't afford it, you guys are going to be in the worst shape. Sorry, Charlie. It's just the way things are. So I'm trying to warn you, stock up now before... Your neighbors are knocking on your door asking if you have any food and you having to tell them, I'm not, I don't have any food even though you got like 18 billion cupboards full of food. You know what I mean? So you don't want to be that neighbor going by asking your neighbor if they have food because more than likely they will tell you no because they will be selfish. They won't be looking out for their neighbor and they won't have a God in which to serve and to depend on who says that I got you. I will provide for you. I will never leave you by, nor by any means forsake you. That's what I'm trying to say. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I got to go. Y'all take care.